Hmm. Hey! Didn't see you there. Shane here from the Spirit of the Cosmos. Belief systems. We're going to go over them and why you should question everything. You should question every single thing you ever hear from anyone. Coming up, let's get started. Alrighty, let's get right on it, my positive peeps. Belief systems, or as I call them, BS. Do they resonate with you? Does your current belief system resonate with you? Are you following a path, a religious path, a spiritual path? Are you an atheist or someone who just had a spiritual awakening? Are you following a path through life, a belief system, and it's just not resonating with you? That's good. That's change. And whether you like change or not is not important because change is coming. During your spiritual awakening or through your journey through your spiritual path in life, you're going to come across belief systems. You might believe things for a certain number of years or your whole entire life and all of a sudden it just does not resonate with you. That is your intuition talking. You know what I think is funny? Humanity has made such great strides in technology, even medicine, all sorts of things. We've really made great strides with this stuff. But there's one huge superpower that we've largely ignored. That is our intuition. And because so many of us ignore our intuition, belief systems have been built and they don't serve people anymore. The world is changing. Change is coming. And whether you like it or not, like I said previously, doesn't really matter because change is coming. Change has to happen always so that an infinite creation can remain infinite. Always moving, always expanding, always changing. Do not fear change or fear your intuition. Do not fear yourself if your belief systems suddenly just do not work for you anymore. That's your gut feeling. That's your higher self sending you down information and telling you your belief system is no longer resonating with you. You need to evolve past it. Belief systems are walls that we build around our own selves because we all create our own reality. It's time to jump over, fly over, or walk through these walls. So as you jump over the walls, as you walk through them, as you tear down your own belief systems, you must learn to question everything. Question everything that anyone ever tells you, including me, question everything I say. You must question everything. Build your own truth. Use your discernment. When you get a bunch of information, when you're surrounded by knowledge, a lot of it's gonna start soaking in. When you're around a lot of wisdom, a lot of it's gonna start soaking in. Use your intuition. Question everything. Does this resonate with me? Does that resonate with me? I don't like this. I don't like that. I enjoy this. I love that. Build a new system of beliefs that works for you. Be who you are 100% and ask yourself, what am I doing to myself? And as you ask yourself, what am I doing to myself? What am I doing for myself? Remember to make sure that your beliefs match who you are. Don't be involved in a belief system that is not resonating with you. If you are in a group or in any type of religious or spiritual group or faith or even a lack of faith, and you suddenly just do not vibe with it anymore. That's not who you are anymore. You have changed, you have evolved, you have jumped over a wall. Make your own reality. Make your own truths by making your beliefs who you are. This is your birthright. Your birthright as a multi-dimensional infinite being that we all are because we are all part of the infinite creation. It is your birthright to create your own reality and we all do, but you have to question everything so you get the best information for yourself, for your own reality that you create. 
question everything. But the only tip I can give you, the rest is up to you, but the only tip I can give you is stay positive. Do not fear anything. Do not fear your own power or intuition. Stay, stay super positive from each now moment to the next because you will love the benefits. When you throw out positive footballs, you get them right back and catch them. And it's a touchdown every time. Question everything. And another pro tip about belief systems. Do not try to violate someone's free will or their birthright of creating their own reality by throwing things at them that you believe are true. Do not try to control them or hammer them or put them down because you and I, everyone around us, we're all on our own spiritual journey. You can cheer people from the sides and go, 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 go. But it is up to the person to make those steps, to move forward down their own spiritual journey, their own created reality. Enough today. I appreciate you watching. Question everything. Be who you are. Be authentic. Be 100% yourself. Thank you for watching the Spirit of the Cosmos. Each of you is a very unique and beautiful person. Give me a like if this video did it for you. Leave a comment down below. Tell me how it did. Share your ideas. What do you question? What belief systems have you gotten over? What walls have you jumped or flown over? Only you can tell me. And I look forward to it because I want to hear your comments and stories. Thank you again for watching the Spirit of the Cosmos. Have a great evening, a great day, a great afternoon, whatever it is in your part of the world. Hey everyone, welcome to the Spirit of the Cosmos. I'm Shane, and you would be too if you were me.